I have not had dental care probably the last four or five years. And after, I, we're in the military and I've ha always had wonderful dental care and the best. And I was taking care of myself, but the last four or five years things changed. My husband had a lot of surgeries. I needed to be helpful. I put myself on the shelf and said, you know, I'll just wait. And uh, when I was ready to go back to my dentist, he had retired. Plus he was out of town and, you know, I hadn't kept up. So now I had to find a dentist. And I was so embarrassed to even go because, especially when my front teeth looked so bad and I kind of lost my self-esteem, didn't want to go get any family pictures done, didn't want to go out quite as much. So uh, my husband decided to go with me and we went to two interviews and it didn't work out for me and that didn't help any. So I was almost resigned at my age to say, well, maybe I just can't do any better. When you get older, you just can't do anything to look a little better, you know. And we went on the web and we saw the advertisement for this clinic. And that's how we found the, this, this particular clinic. And my husband said, well, I'll go with you for confidence. And we came in and we, we talked to Lisa. And uh, it was a very good experience, but I was nervous. And I made sure that my husband went with me for the examination and stayed with me the whole way. And he was afraid I was going to back out. And uh, when we left here, I felt very comfortable, as comfortable as I could be. I was embarrassed because my feelings looked bad, my teeth were yellow, I had no self-esteem. and. Uh, but the way it turned out was really the turning point for me. Not, not only was the clinic helpful, it was comfortable to sit there and talk about it, but I, I didn't feel embarrassed. It, I felt like they had seen it before, they understood. I was given several choices of what I wanted to do with my, what plans I had. Some were my own, some were suggested by Dr. Edwards. And uh, we went home and we took our time to make a, make a decision. And uh, my husband helped with that. And we came to a good plan that I felt I, I could live with, a plan that we could afford to do. And when I came back to try and execute that plan, I found that that's exactly what I could do. I wasn't pushed into a corner. I wasn't told you have to do this or we can't help you. I picked and chose and I got exactly what I wanted. The laser, I didn't know anything about it when I first came in, but I was always open to trying things. And my experience really was with a laser or uh, it was a very good experience. Um, I thought it was kind of amazing what the laser could do without causing any great pain. I had a lot done, but I can't say that there was really a lot of pain in any of it. It, it was just totally beneficial for me. I decided to go ahead and have scaling done because I did have some beginning problems with uh, a little bit of bleeding when in one area and stuff like that, and I was afraid of the scaling because what I thought it would do is take some of my gums away and maybe show my roots or something because I knew nothing about scaling. But as it turned out, scaling was, was good. It was good for me. It felt good. I went home, I looked in the mirror. It looked great. And now I can brush my teeth. I floss. I'm very careful with everything. And I don't see any blood. It feels great. And that's not only the front teeth, but all the way in the back too. So uh, I had a lot of different procedures here and I wanted to get my teeth widened, which actually I thought couldn't be done because one of the two clinics I went to prior to coming here, I was actually told that I was too old to do that and that my yellow things that I was so embarrassed about uh, was part to uh, tetracycline antibiotic stains and widening would be out. And that devastated me, but I came to this clinic thinking that this was true.
But it wasn't true. I had my teeth widened. I, could, I can see the difference today. And that was so important to me. You know, not even so thinking about how healthy it was to have everything fixed, but just to have them wider was a big deal. I said, you know, somebody should know how this changed my life. And I told him how it changed my life. And that's how, you know, I wanted that to go on record, because I know there's other people like me. Little darling, it seems like it.